The first thing you'll want to do is find out where the centre of your paper plate is. I know that my paper plates are 23 centimetres from side to side, so I'm going to use a ruler to work out where the middle of my paper plate is. Once I've figured out where the centre of my paper plate is, I'm going to push my sharp pencil through this point and I'm going to keep pushing until the metal part where the rubber is touches the underside of my paper plate. I'm not going to push the pencil right the way up to be level with the paper plate because I'm going to be doing this on a picnic table where there's a hole that that bit of pencil can sit down through. You'll want your pencil to be standing straight up and down and you might need to use some blue tack or some tape to help secure it in position. And you'll also want to make sure that your paper plate isn't going to blow away. For this you could use some stones to weigh it down, you could tape it onto the ground or I'm using blue tack to stick it onto the top of the picnic table. Now that my pencil is standing upright and my paper plate is stuck to the table, I'm ready to start the activity of marking down the hours on my paper plate.